Hey everybody, I was wondering if you can clone an original PS3 drive to an SSD and would you have some upsides? So I did this proof of concept, this is not a tutorial, this is just my experience. Yes you can and it does work. So I did a complete clone byte by byte uh, with an LMA software from this hard drive to an SSD by Western Digital. You do lose your free space because uh, the most suitable uh, size for me to upgrade was 500 gigs from 320 which means that I lose about 100 or something which is not a problem for me because I don't really uh, install big, bigger games and uh, by the way the health of your SSD should improve if it does not use the whole capacity which should be a consideration if you're installing an SSD into the system that you are heavily using which is once again not the case for me uh, do you lose any uh, custom software or whatever it is? Han, no, you do not. It, the transition seemed very seamless. The cloning took about 30 to 40 minutes for me. Uh, and as you can see, the game starts pretty fast. Uh, what should feel to me as blazing fast for PlayStation 3, because it is not the quickest system, especially in terms of I.O. Uh, on a previous hard drive, uh, which uh, shows its age for sure, uh, this same uh, process just stopped twice, did not start at all. Although this game worked for me previously, and mind you, this is just a byte-by-byte -byte copy. So the data is not lost, the game is still working, the, my, syst my system was not corrupted or something, but still I have this result, which shows, uh, at least to me, that this upgrade is worthwhile. If you're looking to get one terabyte or something, maybe that becomes uh, too expensive. In my case, I thought that's good enough. Uh, I'm not going to keep this SSD, but I've tested it and it does work. So if that helps you at all, uh, you're welcome. If you want to ask a question, maybe I can answer it. Have a good day, everybody.